Assalamu alaikum. There is a dramatic increase in the incidence of eyesight problems in children and college or university students. About 80% of university students wear glasses in Asian countries because of a highly pressurized educational system requiring long hours of studies in schools as well as colleges. So this puts a lot of strain on the eyes. In addition, too much use of digital screens for socializing, entertainment, as well as for online studies recently has multiplied this eye strain 100 times. I've made this video to guide parents as to how we can minimize this harm done to our eyes. I hope this will prove useful. The major culprit in causing problems with eyesight is an overuse and misuse of eyes. Usually a bad posture is adopted while reading and writing, working on computers or watching television. Children develop a habit from a very young age to bend the head down while reading or writing and watching computer screens. The weight of the head is about 20 to 27 kilograms and this weight is then shifted to the eyes and causes a lot of eye strain and pressure on the neck as well as the whole back. Therefore, children should always be encouraged not to study lying down in bed or sitting on a carpet with the book placed in their lap or uh, on the carpet. This high pressure for long hours causes weakening of eyesight and progression of the number of spectacles. Children should always sit up straight as shown in the picture on the table and chair and the book should be held at an eye level and they should write with the head and the back kept straight. Computer screen should always be at the eye level and with their head and back well supported on a chair or on a sofa. It should not be washed in uh, while sitting down in bed. In addition to the long study hours, the overuse and misuse of small digital screens for entertainment, socializing, and then studies causes a lot of eye strain. So the main reason why this is uh, causing such a problem is because these digital screens, they emit radio frequency waves, and these radio frequency waves cause a lot of harm to the developing brain as well as the developing immature eyes of children. Children have a bad habit of holding the screen very close to the eyes. So this, the, the radiation emitted, it damages their very immature brains and the eyes. Then the bad posture adopted while watch, watching these dis, uh, digital screens with the head bent down and the neck and back strained. Then nighttime use of digital screens disrupts the sleep and multiplies eye strain. Watching TV in the bedroom is again a very bad habit. Even when the TV is turned off, it emits radiation and it stays in the bedroom and it disturbs a person's sleep. So TV should never be kept in the bedroom. Disruption of sleep interferes with body growth and it weakens the eyesight. Therefore, children or anyone should not start watching a digital screen when it's their regular sleep time. A person must turn all their screens off and uh, uh, about half an hour before it's their regular sleep time. So how to take care of our eyes and how to avoid uh, the progression of number of our glasses is that a proper posture must be adopted while reading, writing, drawing. It's a duty of parents to 
teach their children to sit on the table and chair with the book held in front of the eyes and head and back kept supported and straight. They should never lie down in bed or sit on the carpet to read or write. The room should always be well lit. They should not be allowed to study in dim light or in a dark room. Children must be encouraged to sleep at a proper time for seven to eight hours at night. They should not start watching TV or study or uh, watch a digital screen before their regular sleep time or late into the night. Children must spend two hours daily in outdoor activities like walking, cycling, playing sports because latest research has proven that uh, outdoor activities they prevent the progression of myopia and they help relax the uh, muscles, eye muscles and in, uh, help in uh, improving our eyesight. Every person must take a regular 5 to 10 minutes break every 30 to 40 minutes while reading or studying for long hours. Children must be encouraged to eat a healthy diet if they want to keep their eyesight strong with fresh fruit, vegetables, milk, eggs and regular eye exercises especially the convergence exercises help strengthen the eye muscles. I have uh, posted videos on uh, YouTube as well as Facebook how to do the convergence exercises properly. I hope these instructions will help parents in uh, protecting their children and improving their eyesight. If there are any questions or queries, you can post under this video. And for clinic appointment, you can call this number. Thank you very much for watching the video.